Hi everyone, it's Lehman with Lace Covered Skies. I'm here today to do a mask making share video. And this is going to be a mask making share video of the tutorial that I did on how to print onto tissue paper. And printing onto tissue paper is kind of like making your own napkins. So whatever you can do with your napkins, you can do with this. And when you do this, you're not so dependent on the selection of napkins at the store at Tuesday morning because you can choose any design you want. It's super simple and so cool. In the last video, um, I showed you how to do this with just regular tissue paper that is so inexpensive and you can use um, just scrap paper, paper that you're throwing out that's the right size that will go into a printer. So it's super inexpensive to do. And you're using up a lot of things that um, you might have lying around, like old tissue paper from um, Christmas, papers that you throw out, like from, I don't know, Maybe you printed out a recipe. Now you don't need it anymore. You can use that scrap paper to um, print this out. So I will link the tutorial down below and I will show you everything that I was able to do this with. And pretty much, I mean, you can do it with any digital, right? Or any public domain image that you find. But this is a French receipt from TaylorMade Journal. And I think it turned out so cool. This is going to be awesome for collage. This is also from TaylorMade Journals. This is her grungy vintage wallpaper. I love this print, so I wanted to see how it would turn out on tissue paper. This paper is from Jenny All Sorts. You guys have seen me use this many times. I love this paper. This is from Adamo Prince, and I think it is so cool. And this definitely has like a napkin vibe, so this will be really cool for decoupage. along with this one. Now this is also from Adamo Prince and I just think these flowers are so beautiful. This is from Mixed Media Minnesota. It turned out really pretty. Again, I think this would be so pretty in collage. I can't wait to try it. This next set right here is from KB and Friends. I am working on some sewing journals, so I thought it would be cool to print out some of these and experiment. It just feels so cool too when you're holding it. I love this kit, it's just gorgeous. Okay, but I'm excited to see how it turns out. So I will be cutting. I'm gonna cut where I wanna start using it, but I also have to cut off of the tape. So, like the tape ends right here, but I'm not gonna use this part. So I'm just cutting where this starts. And then I'm going to cut where the tape ends, which is just inside of, um, of where the digital starts. And then this, the tape ends right here, but I'm going to go ahead and cut on the line. Right, so I'm going to quickly cut the rest of these and we can see what we have 
at the end here. Now it's, it is a little hard to see where the tape begins and ends. All right. So isn't that cool? I'm definitely going to be using this to Mod Podge onto something. And a little bonus is that this piece of the tape, I think would look really good in collaging. Just that little piece. So I'm going to save that piece. I'm just going to stick it onto my wall. All right, so let's just continue cutting. I have been working on my sewing journals and I've gotten all the signatures sewn in um, I don't know the order of how I'm releasing these videos so it might it might not make sense like from the last video to this video depending on what I talked about <laughs> but in real time, I am, it almost looks like pattern paper, but I am decorating the sewing journals. All the signatures have been sewn in. Um, it was a lot of sewing because I'm working on six journals at a time. And next, I will be decorating. So I'm going to be using all the ephemera that I have made on camera with you guys, along with some that I have made off camera. And I'm going to be filling out those journals. See, this is kind of, I feel like at this point, I can just kind of tear it if I could fit the tape. Okay, I'm not sure where the tape is ending or starting. Yeah, it's pretty strong tissue paper. I'm going to go ahead and cut this off here. There we go. Alright, but I think it's going to be boring if I cut all these in front of you guys. But you can see just how... Let me get rid of this tape. Just how beautiful it is. Just the texture and the translucence nature of tissue paper gonna lay it on top of each other and you can just see how beautiful it is well <laughs> this is one of those things where it's just pretty look to look at I think this would be even really cool not junk journal related but if you're giving a small gift to have this as a tissue paper I just love this project so much <laughs> but um Okay, sorry about that. I thought my camera stopped recording. <laughs> um, but if you like this idea, I hope you'll give me a thumbs up down below so that more people can see this. And if you know someone that might like this idea, um, I would love if you shared this video. And I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel for more videos. Um, thank you so much for watching today, and I will talk to you next time. Bye, everyone.